three of your Wednesday weight loss challenge. That's right. How are you feeling? Uh, wasting away is with shadow. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Um, I'm not feeling so optimistic this week, to be honest. Why not? I think you've been eating a bit too much. No, I haven't. What, what do you mean? What do you mean? Uh, okay, so I knew that we were going to have two dinners out, but that turned into three. Three nights in a row we went out for restaurant dinners. Um, that wouldn't be so bad, but I don't think you possibly ordered the best thing. sounds awful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was, it was hell. <laughs> I think your choices could have been a bit better. <laughs> How? Um, well, at one dinner... They didn't have gruel on the menu. No. At one dinner, you had a bread roll to start, which I always think is completely unnecessary. And then I didn't have my roll, so you had my roll as well. So yeah. that's two bread rolls yeah. before you even had your dinner. Yeah, but they were little dinner rolls. They were, that's, that was practically my only bread the, for the week. Yeah, they were pretty big. <sighs> okay, that's just one thing. So, and then <laughs> last night we went out to dinner again. Yeah. That was unplanned. And you had your main course and then after that and this wasn't your fault because they brought them they brought the food over out of sequence but you had your starter after your main as my dessert <laughs> as your dessert and it was a plate of basically deep fried calamari <laughs> you make it sound so bad and it was a big size plate it was beautiful and it just looked like there was a lot of oil on that and I it just, wasn't actually it was very it was it was practically dry Okay, I've got a very bad feeling about the weigh-in, I just have to say. And another thing, I think you're snacking too much. And no. Yeah, I'll, we'll, well, we'll talk about that we'll later. We'll talk about that later. I feel that I've actually done all right this week. I feel like I've lost a bit, you know, lost some weight. So what do you think, how much do you think you've lost? I reckon, I reckon um, I'm pretty confident of getting you know, round about a kilo, I think. Or, Ooh, I think... Well, you know. I think... Nothing. I, nothing. Yeah. If, if not put on a little bit. Oh, come on. No, that couldn't be. Okay, well, let's just go and If that's the case, we, need, you know, we buy new scales next week. <laughs> okay, well, let's go and wait. All right. Now. Okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm a bit, I'm a bit worried about this. Okay, hop on. This is the moment of truth. 113.3. Okay. Okay. Well, I think an apology is in order. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so relieved. <laughs> you lost 300 grams. Yeah, well, actually, I, you know, I'll, I'll be honest, I thought I would have lost a bit more, but. Um, yeah, I guess, is that, do you think that's uh, good at this stage or not? Look, I thought, going by what you ate last week, I actually expected, if not nothing, that you would have put on a little bit. <sighs> yeah, I did. So, <sighs> I'm so happy I'm that... mortified that you say that. Well, yeah. I'm so happy that the scales are down. So, it's not as much as you were expecting, but for me, that's a relief because I was sure that there would be no... Weight loss. We, you, you were trying to make sure of that last night because you took that extra fish fillet and you put it on my plate. <laughs> so I think you were trying to sabotage me, weren't you? <laughs> Nobody force fed you the deep fried calamari. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so can I just go into a bit more detail about why I was kind of negative about last week? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> <laughs> so I mentioned snacking and snacking has been a big issue for you the whole way and the idea was that you would cut out so much snacking right well and well also yes if you mean things like toast and stuff like that i just mean snacking in general and i'll just continue <laughs> and <laughs> what you have done and it's very very tricky very cunning you've um stopped having the snacks but now you're just adding them to the end of your meals so you have the same sort of snacky things like you'll have um, a yogurt or a pack of cranberries or biscuits or um, whatever 
and you'll have your lunch and then you'll have one of those snacks. So I guess in your mind it doesn't count as a snack because it's now part of, a lunch. part of a lunch, but it's the same amount of calories and food as if you just had the snack. So say you're having three snacks a day and each snack is say under 150 calories. So that's about 450 calories. Yeah. Um, and then a couple of apples or an apple and a couple of carrots. Mm. So that's another say 150. So now what are we up to? The carrots have calories. Yeah, of course they do. The other, they're sort of like negative. No, 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 no. <laughs> the only I, negative is the taste. <laughs> I, I, oh, they're lovely. Oh. Well, I thought, I thought the, the fact of eating a carrot would burn up more calories than it gave you. <laughs> no, nice fairy tale, isn't it? So what did I work out? Three times 150, 450 plus maybe another 150. That's 600 calories of sort of additionals. That's all right. It's not all right. Why is, why is it not all right? Because it all adds up and on top of breakfast and lunch and dinner, I think you're going a little bit too high. Well, what do you think I would uh, eat in a day in terms of calories? Oh boy. Um, look, we're not really counting your calories. I think that's what you like to do. Uh, yeah, for me. But I think for you, a guy can eat a lot more calories than a woman um, yes. and lose weight just because of your body composition. Um, which is so unfair. So I don't actually count calories for you. What we're doing is instead of counting calories, you're eating similar foods and cutting down on portions and cutting out all that bread and cutting out some snacks. And that's naturally cutting your calories down to probably a deficit. So by not cutting out those snacks, that's kind of going against what I'm trying to do. I propose your challenge for this coming week is to cut your snacks to just two a day and that means if you have an apple that's a snack and I don't care when you have them so if you want to tack them onto the end of a meal that's fine and one of those Greek yogurts would count as a snack as well so each thing is roughly about 150 calories keep them to two a if, day. I call, if I call the yogurt dessert does that mean it's no longer a snack? No. <laughs> dessert slash snack. Have, have dinner and then have, have a yogurt afterwards, that's for dessert. So that's not a snack. No, I'm counting that. <laughs> I'm counting that as a snack. <laughs> okay? <laughs> so that's... You change the rules. To, to, I do. You're trying to make me fail. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm trying to make you... If you don't look good, I don't look good. <laughs> should be a t-shirt. <laughs> that's right. So that's your challenge for next week. And, um, uh, all right. Okay, and we only have one dinner out next week. Do we? Oh, okay. Yeah, yep. just one. So that should make a difference. And cutting the snacks down and everything else, all good. I'm very proud of you. Thank you, Dummy. So we will be back next Wednesday and that will be week four of the Wednesday Weight Loss Challenge. So tune in for that and hopefully a much better result. And I bring out new videos, as always, every fabulous Friday. Love to see you then. And love you to subscribe to my channel just by clicking the subscribe button. And you can keep up with everything. Thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.